I hope you're all doing well. Um, horrible day today. Anyway, I'm here with John who has come to have a look at our solar panels and see if they need cleaning. Now we put solar panels in about six years ago now um, and they've never been cleaned yet. So I imagine after you've cleaned a solar panel, it's gonna make a massive difference. So I think, I'm not actually sure because we've not actually done it before, but um, he's got his cherry picker here. So we're gonna go up and have a look, aren't we? This is John. Yeah, I see anything me. Good. <laughs> uh, yeah, so we're going to head up and see what the crack is up there. It's a safety harness, so um, if we were to fall out, it keeps you locked in. That'll do. Now, it is meant to be a bit tight because yeah. if it's loose, that feels good. What happens is uh, if you were to dangle in a harness for too long and it's too loose it cuts off your blood flow and you'd end up dying really <laughs> yeah a lot of people that fall out of cherry uh, harnesses and things like that with these, with these harnesses on the reason why they actually end up passing away is not from the fall but from the fact that they got stuck up there no way and nobody was there to get them down in time and the thing wasn't fitted properly oh wow it clips in so just grab it around that one there yep Agricultural sites like dairy farms, chicken sheds, pig sheds. Yeah. There's an awful lot of traffic in the air, like bedding up with dust. And, yeah, yeah. Um, amazingly, when they're on top of cow sheds, you know when you rub a cow's back and it's like dusty and greasy. Greasy, at the same yeah. Time, that's what you'll find on solar panels. Ah. It's not about appearance; it's about money. Yeah, efficiency. Uh, it's a it's a little bit of a shameless sales pitch for myself, but I do like to remind customers that I'm probably one of the few people that comes to their farm and immediately starts making them money. Not many people do that. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good point. <laughs> got rain on at the moment but it's not yeah. rinsing it off it's just wetting it and then it'll dry off and then it'll all dry off and then it'll be a sediment that you can't see yeah you can see already you can see on like the middle one it's grimy as yeah so how do you actually wash them do you have a brush yeah so i've got this extendable pole it's a bit like a window cleaner's pole mm -hmm. but it takes a pressure washer jet through it right. and then there's a spinning brush about that big like that and then wow. deionize water just like the window cleaners use yeah so it's um 
it's not non-charge so it's negatively charged so dirt attracts to dirt so when you've got something that's deionized in water it'll stay cleaner for longer yeah it'll lift the dirt off quicker that's obviously we can never totally prevent dirt coming back no no but it delays it by a bit more if i was to use just standard issue mineral water from your tap the, there's loads of calciums and magnesiums and all sorts in there yeah that would leave a residue just like if you were to go and clean your windows with tap water there'd be streaks you'd yeah. see little streaks and spots and it's the same principle really wow. um so yeah you can see there see at the bottom it's all collecting yeah and here yeah oh wow yeah so yeah i, I would say worth a clean of this you definitely don't be scared yeah, I bet it does. Because <laughs> it don't feel that secure. Because it's like wobbly, isn't it? It feels wobbly when you. It's very wet. Yeah, you've got the ducks. Yeah. Are you a duck farmer? We're not yet. We might transition. <laughs> I'm not too sure if you can milk a duck. No, me neither. <laughs> Looks cool though, doesn't it, from this high up? Doesn't it? Yeah. So, how high are we now? 45 feet. 45 feet. Looking smart, Evie. Looks well, doesn't it? Clean, um, concrete, all flowing the right way. The rain helps with that, washes it off. Yeah, they're all milking cows here. Yeah, we know you can Yeah, and there. Three sheds of them. Right. What's coming up for us? Should I unclip or just get out? Yeah. Do the full quote. Quick figure because uh, Dad's just on the phone and I'll just run down and show him. Stop. He's the boss at the end of the day, not me. So, I have no idea what my hair is doing. Um, yeah, he's given us a quote and Dad's agreed to it. Not and he's on with cleaning the solar panels. So, I'm just going to go up and see what he's actually doing. He did say he had a long brush with like a power washer jet in it that basically like a window cleaner so we're gonna go up there and see what he's up to um i've got the whole tribe of dogs because i'm on the bike oh dotty you do that every time and you mucky everyone up i've had my harness on the whole time and i've been like cleaning my stables out and stuff <laughs> difference where I've been. Oh hell yeah. That's like I was gonna say like glass but it is like glass in it. Yeah. But yeah you can definitely tell so obviously he's done this side of the solar panels and you can see the grime on this side. Oh yeah big difference. Right nice you're gonna have a go now. Oh. This does not mean you get it any cheaper though because you can tell some other work. <laughs> <laughs> I think it should do. Put a bit of pressure on it, or not really? No, it's because it's uh, five kilos on the end. Right. That's enough weight. It's and because the surface area contacts it, because it's a, it's a circle hitting the square, it's only the little bottom bit that's getting it. So the surface area is quite small, so therefore the downfall is quite large. Right. But yeah, what I'm going to do is a good, this is a good test to see how they're doing. You see the bottom here? The yeah. bottom white line? Yeah, yeah make a real effort to really scrub that bit, get it nice and lovely like that. Yeah. So when I ask you in about three, four months time, yeah. go and have a look. You've got a little personnel basket here. Yeah, yeah, we have. Yeah. Get yourself up there. And once you see that dirt appearing, and then swipe your hand on with a clean hand, and then yeah. it's all dirty, then if you again. Thank you to call me again. Yeah. Very satisfying, my friend. Every every minute I'm making an improvement in my job. Yeah. Nice. Uh, you got it? Yeah, it fairly takes you, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. Be strong.
careful not to go over the top edge because yeah. it's always wanting to race ahead and it'll drop off but it's all right it does happen and there's a way to get it back it's easy isn't it really very easy so just let it drift up to the top just hold it there I might need to get you a bit closer, there. Oh, there we go. Missed it. <laughs> Top right. There you go. Don't be half jobbing it. Get it back a bit. That's what my granddad used to say. Get it back a bit. Well, ready? Yeah. Let's drop it back. Yeah. Oi. Well done. But it's, you need, you're like strong arms by the end of it. Alright. Keep strong, rest of your lad. Yeah, just keeping hold of it. <laughs> I'm going to leave the video there now, guys. Thanks so much for watching. If you haven't done already, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Don't forget to um, use that little discount code if you do want any skylight solar panels. It does like big parlours, like rotary parlours and stuff like that. If you want anything cleaning, Use that little code, Margaret is a legend. Um, and yeah, you get 10% off. Uh, anyway, yeah, I'm gonna carry on milking. So I'll see you on the next one, guys. Bye.